Hello everyone, my name is Shazeb Hamid and welcome to AI Sciences. Today we are going to learn how we can develop a project for converting text to image, right? So for this project, we are going to use actually a very beautiful built-in, uh, you know, module or system that is called Delhi Mini. So first of all, let me cover a little bit about what is Delhi Mini. So if any of you is not familiar with Hugging Face, then let me open Hugging Face here. Okay, so I have opened Hugging Face as you can see. So in the Hugging Space Spaces, Delhi Mini is available, right? It was launched as a project for Hugging Face uh, one year back almost. And now it has been converted to Cryon.com, right? So what does it do? It uh, it is uh, actually what I told you, right? So we give it a prompt and it gives us a response, right? So let's suppose we have given it a prompt cat using bike and we run it, then it will give us a response according to that, right? So uh, I have actually opened cryon.com before as well. Let me open that. Okay, so there we go. This is it. So I have written cat using bike here right and i have clicked this button and with the help of that i have got a lot of pictures in which cat or cats are using different type of bikes now i can actually uh, you know change this command as well uh, you uh, you will be uh, you know very much familiar to know that of course this is an ai video and this is actually not the you know images that were uh, present before a lot of images were created with the help of artificial intelligence right so delhi mini is a module which will help us create multiple type of images with the help of whatever command or whatever work we give it so let's suppose if i was to give it something like dog using car what does it do then let's see let me give it a little bit time so there we go this is the result right so this is these are the images that are given to us when we asked delhi mini to give us images related to dog using car so this is an ai project as i have told you before right so now what we are going to do is of course if we are going to see how we can use this sort of uh, cryon.com or delhi mini in python right so for that let me just close these windows and the first thing you need to do is you need to open up your google colab right after opening a google colab you need to install the delhi mini so let's write pip install m i n min delhi dash q so let's run this what it will do is it will install delhi mini into our google colab let's do that and once we have uh, done that the next part is actually to import Delhi Mini, right? So uh, let's give it a little bit of time because it is right now connecting, right? So let's pause the video. Okay, so now that Delhi Mini has been installed, what is the next step? The next step is actually to import Delhi Mini. So it is available in Mini Delhi. So let's write it from min underscore delhi what should we get we should import min delhi so let's run this okay so after that what is the next step the next step is to actually build up the model so how can we build up the model we have actually two arguments that we must take into account during the development of 
Delhi Mini model, right? So first one is if you want to use the mega form of that uh, Delhi Mini or the simple form. If uh, we want to use the mega form, then we say that the is mega is equal to true, right? I am going to do that right now. And if we want to see whether the content that we are doing is reusable or not, right? So if it is reusable, then we say that is reusable is equal to true. And if we do not want the content to repeat that way, what we can do is we can actually tell it that uh, it should not reuse the content. So both of these things come into play when we are talking about what model development. So let's write model is equal to min delay. This is the module that we imported. So I'm using that, right? So min delay. after that, I'm going to write is mega equal to true. And after that, I'm going to write is reusable reusable uh, usable reusable equal to true so let's run this as well let's give it a little time in the meantime let's actually start writing the next part of the code right so in the next part what we need to do is we need to pass in a text into this model right so for that the first thing that we need is a text so let's write text is equal to cat using bike and after that what we need to do is we need to actually use the display option so for that i'm going to write that display and what should it display it should display model dot generate underscore image right and what should be the image based on it should be based on text so now we will see how this works after this is done okay so now that it has completed running let's actually see what does this gives us okay so it is giving us an error let me see this okay so there are actually two more things that we need to take care of the first thing is actually the seed and the second thing is the grid size so what does the grid size tell us the grid size tell us uh, what will be the actually uh, will it will be a two by two grid in which there will be four images or four by four in which we will have 16 images things like that right so we will have to actually tell it both of these things right so first of all let's say that the seed is six and other than that grid size is let's write grid size is equal to two for now right and if we are taking both of these terms then we should actually write seed comma grid size here so let's write that there we go now let's see what does it gives us if we have done everything right okay so now again of course it will take a little bit of time there we go this is the result that we are getting and this is the cat on a bike right and of course it took a lot of time almost four minutes and what is the reason for that one of the reasons is that actually uh, right now uh, the mega uh, you know uh, was not available so that i'll have to use the uh, simple delhi mini so the results were not that much good actually after that what we did was we actually uh, you know changed it and i wrote it again and i ran it again so as you can say that for you know cat using bike these results are a lot better right than these results
so this actually does not even look like a cat right and this one maybe looks more like a mouse than a cat right so what is the reason for that there are actually two reasons the number one is CUDA was not available and the second reason is we had to use the Delhi mini small right however in this case uh, what we used was we used Delhi mini large so it has more freedom and it was able to give us even better results so this is it this is the way that you can actually develop a text to image uh, you know uh, model very briefly and with a little bit of previous knowledge right so of course there are not that much uh, difficult lines of code in this as well and i'll also be sharing the uh, notebook for your further assistance so this is it for today if you want to keep watching videos like this please subscribe to ai sciences